There are several groups of students here at Point Park University that seem to rule the school. You have the dancers, the sports stars, and the communication students, just to name a few. However, a major mass of students that seem to fly under the radar are the commuters. It's a lot cheaper and easier for me to commute to Point Park. Living on campus is expensive and I live so close, so I might as well just commute. Most people accept that university life is not always exactly how real life is going to pan out. Commuters get a taste of that even if they're living with their parents beforehand. People who live on campus often don't get that consideration until they have their degree, they're out the house and they're like, okay, now what? Like Hannah, Sarah is a part of the 75% of Point Park University students who commute. She also is the president of the Commuter Club. Commuter Club we call it an interest-based organization. However, there is an element of community service, service to the commuters. I mean, we are here to help integrate them into the social life, to create events that they'll be able to come to, to make them feel more welcome on campus. I advise the commuter club. Uh, I work in conjunction with United Student Government, who currently fund the bus pass discount. Um, I have off-campus apartment listings available. We do a lot of different things for commuters. Sarah spent some of her spare seconds on campus here in the commuter lounge. Commuters are encouraged to check the bulletin boards, catch up on their Z's, or play a game. I think the hardest thing is starting to get involved. It can feel difficult to get involved. However, the effort that it takes just to get involved and incorporate it into your routine is absolutely worth it. One main issue right now is transportation. The USG just cut the budget for discounted bus passes by $4,000 and that makes it a lot harder for me to get to school and this is to fund clubs which seems less important than me actually being able to get my education. We're in a big, big change in transportation with the port authority changes and the parking downtown changes. Parking's the big issue right now. Aside from trying to tackle the commuters' concerns, the club is preparing several events to engage commuting students' participation. We're hoping for enough money to do a monthly um, coffee for commuter, also called commuter breakfasts. It's an event that was started by the Office of Commuter Affairs, and it would be, you know, breakfast, food, a relaxing atmosphere. I'm AJ Zala, Point Park University.